Hello and welcome to our learning to cook pizza journey. Today I'm going to be cooking in the Unicoda. I'm going to be making big pizza, 15 to 16 inches, as big as I can possibly make it. Let's do it. Here it is. So I used my my new wooden peel. I am using a square peel here only because I couldn't fit I couldn't turn it really well with my small circular turning peel and so I'm using this one what was happening is is that I'm filming with my left hand and I can't pull the pizza out to turn it so I'm I'm turning it with the square peel which I think is it's working all right actually I didn't think it would be um, as easy as this I thought turning it like this would be a bit harder but it's working so um I don't know if other people use the square peel to turn I I think it's uh, it's kind of worked out. It's turning. Done. This is dough I made oh, a while ago now, it's been frozen and I defrosted it, like a 65% hydration dough because it was so wet and sticky. Yeah, it's been frozen for a good while, it cooked really well. Give that a try. The stone was at 440 degrees centigrade in the top far right corner. It was about 430 in the middle, so I think that was like a really good cook. And with that hydration as well, the high hydration, it's cooked really good. In 
that fast time, I managed to cook the mozzarella really well. I love that, that's just right for me. Not too burnt, not too uncooked. Another good crust, gosh, this cooked fast. And I think that was me launching it in, it got a bit crumpled there, but yeah, I'm not used to making such big pizza, to be honest. Normally a more, more regular size, like 10 to 12 inch pizza. Very nice, let me just cut this bit up. Mm. I did use a rolling pin, but still got the crust, the, the leoparding on the end which is exactly what I wanted. I'm really pleased with it, very tasty. Just give that bit a try. Actually, I'm gonna give, oops. I'm gonna give that bit a try. Mm. Very nice, 15 to 16 inch pizza there. That's as big as I can do it, um, and I really enjoyed it. And it was easy to cook in the Coda 16 as well, which is really good. Very nice, take care. Hope you enjoyed this vid. See you soon. Bye. And don't forget to check out our website, gottoeatpizza.com. Link is below.